with this, if you pick up in this session, I want to talk about the power of ideas. We talk about God's big idea. I want to have you write down a few things. God's big idea. There's nothing on earth more powerful than an idea. Nothing on earth is more powerful than an idea. Please write that down. Ideas produce everything. Ideas produce everything. The chair that you're sitting on was first an idea. The shoe on your feet was first an idea. This building we are in was first an idea. The suit on your back and the dress you are wearing was first an idea. This conference was first an idea. And your being here sitting in the conference was first an idea in your mind. Everything on earth is a product of ideas. That leads me to point number three. Everything began as an idea. Everything. Here's a principle, number four. Ideas produce everything. That's how powerful they are. We don't think much about the concept of idea, but idea is the source of everything. They're powerful. Number five, ideas are more powerful than death. Because death cannot kill an idea. Ideas outlive men. You can kill a man, but you can't destroy his ideas. They are that powerful. Number six, ideas cannot be destroyed. Ideas cannot be destroyed. Do you see why we got to talk about them? They are the most powerful thing. They outlive men. They produce everything. Everything comes from them. And we have ignored ideas. Number seven, ideas submerge and they re-emerge in generations. This is why Solomon, the great king of Israel, in his discourse on sarcasm, on sarcasm, or sarcasm, we call it, the book of Ecclesiastes is a sarcasm, a sarcastic book. In that book, the king says these words. There is nothing new under the sun. In other words, if you think you have a new idea, it was here before. So ideas submerge. In other words, they could be lost to an entire generation. And then they can re-emerge in the next generation. Ideas never die. They just submerge. Ideas control the world. Write that down. The world is actually ruled by dead men. Hmm. America is actually governed by dead people. (laughs) 
They died, but their ideas are still ruling the country. Let's talk about it a minute. You know, democracy was an idea that was invented by Plato. Socrates discussed it. Aristotle debated the idea of democrata. Democrata, krata, democrata is a Greek word which we embrace as democracy. Democracy was invented by the Greeks, Greek philosophers, and they all died, but democracy is still here. And it's ruling America. So America is actually being ruled by dead people. Hello? You cannot kill an idea. This is why we are having difficulty with terrorism. Terrorism is not a person. It's an idea. And if you kill a person with an idea, the idea usually multiplies. Powerful ideas. So if you were to destroy bin Laden, you could not destroy terrorism. Chances are you might multiply it. We call it martyrdom. When you martyr a person, you produce more of them. Because it's not the person you're after, it's the idea. And you cannot shoot an idea with a bullet. They're powerful. So the most important thing on earth is an idea. You'll never change until you change your ideas. That's why I'm here. I'm not here to keep you knowing what you know. But what you know may not be so. Unless you learn something new, you are not growing. Hi, thank you so much for watching. Please remember you can support our work on our Patreon page and you get access to exclusive content and full videos. And please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so and click the notification bell to be the first to receive newer content. Please don't forget to like and share this video with your friends to be a blessing to them.